been a record-breaking summer season, not for warmth, but for the cool temperatures. The coldest July on record was likely nice for your electric bill, but a real pain for local pools. News 3's Brad Chamson is live in our Rock County Bureau with how some municipal pools are managing to keep their heads above water. Brad? Well, Andy, there were really only a handful of days this summer where going out to the pool really felt like a good idea. Otherwise, that trip just may not have sounded as good as it had in past summers. As a result, in Janesville and Beloit, city pools will not be making a splash at the bank. You know, Mother Nature didn't uh, help us out too much this year. This has been an all-too-common sight in Beloit this summer. The Kruger Municipal Pool is empty, closed due to weather. It's rained either all, all day long or the weather just temperature-wise isn't, you know, appropriate to open. The Beloit pool closed just once in 2008, but so far this year, the gates have been locked on 14 days. When the pool's not open, no money is coming in. I think we brought in about 36, 37,000 is what we brought in just on daily admissions. Um, this year, you know, I haven't looked at it uh, within the last three, four days, um, but the last time I checked, we were at about 21, 22, somewhere in there. The hardest thing to budget for, both your expenses and revenues, is the aquatic budget. You are totally dependent on the weather. Janesville's pools are faring a bit better. Some days saw only a few swimmers and officials are still expecting a loss. I think it'll be probably three or four thousand dollars and I think really the only thing that kept us in that ballpark was in June we had some really really hot days because if you take out those hot days we had we did not do well at all this summer. Both cities say they'll be all right this year, but certainly not doing as well as they'd like. The lowered revenue stream this summer may impact expanded and added programs in each pool, but neither facility is sinking. In terms of what it does for us, we'll just go on. Janesville's Rockport pool closed for the season last Sunday, so their numbers are pretty much set. Now to Beloit, they're hoping to stay open through Labor Day weekend, so they're really hoping for a couple more nice days to help those numbers, uh, that income number, increase just a little bit. But we've got uh, Prep Mania coming up in just a little bit, so that's a big sign that summer's pretty much done. It is a sure sign. Brad Chamson reporting. Brad, thank you very much.